I'm Brandon with Redstone Solar. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to restart your solar edge inverter. Some of these models have a screen, some of them don't. Some of them are slimmer and smaller, but it's all the same concept, no matter what version of the solar edge inverter that you have. So on your inverter, you're going to have a little switch. What you want to do is switch that from the on to the off position. Wait 30 to 60 seconds, and then you're going to take this black knob and turn that off. So next you wanna go out to your main um, panel. On this panel, you should have a disconnect. You wanna go ahead and turn that disconnect to the off position. You're going to wait 30 seconds and then you're going to turn this back on. If you do not have like a knife blade disconnect that you can turn on and off, go ahead and check your panel and see if there is a breaker in here that is labeled for the solar. There may be a, uh, a red sticker or something that says solar on it. If you turn that breaker off, it'll do the same thing as the AC disconnect. So we've already turned the disconnect off outside and then back on. We're going to go in reverse order. Turn this switch to the on position and then take this toggle and switch it back over. Once you have done that, it's going to take five or so minutes for the inverter to restart, but you've finished the restart process. Once you have finished that, kind of the foolproof way of knowing your system is working and turning on is if you listen carefully after the system has restarted, you will hear a slow or a fast clicking noise. That's essentially the relays clicking over. The solar panels are now producing power. 